What's up guys? So I'm trying the vlog style thing again today. Uh, a couple of you guys in the comments said that you liked it from when I did when I did it yesterday. So I figured why not try it again to see what you guys think. Uh, and since I'm walking, I can do a quick heat check. So I got on uh, some Dr. Doom gear, if you can see that. I mean, you know, Dr. Drain gear. I said Dr. Doom, hello, Dr. Drain gear. Uh, also got the 28s on. Rocking 28s, love those. Anyway, so let's get to the news. Uh, first up, we have the LeBron 11 forging iron. Uh, these were officially announced today by Nike. I know I talked about these yesterday, uh, but Nike Basketball made the official announcement. They are an inspiration. They are inspired by uh, the process of making iron, which is obviously a metaphor for LeBron James and his game and how his game has matured. Um, pricing for these is going to be $200. Nike did not give a hard release date. They said November, which is kind of vague, but we'll see. Um, again, $200. And I also found out that not all of them will come inside of the special box that I showed you guys yesterday. Unfortunately, uh, some of them will come in a regular box and I don't know exactly how they're going to determine which ones will get the fancy box and which ones won't. But as soon as I do find out, I will let you guys know. So keeping it basketball, let's go to the KD6. The KD6 OKC away version was announced today. KD talks about it a little bit, talking about how he feels like his team really comes together when they are away. These are set to go on sale on October 31st. Price is obviously $130. Uh, really great price for the KD6. Really like that shoe. So if it's something that you're into, check that out. And still talking about KD, they uh, KD6 N7. This is the one that benefits the Native American and Aboriginal youth for sports programs. Uh, this one is scheduled to come out on November 9th. I believe it hit the China site. So I believe it was Marquis Soul. So you can check out the images of that here. And while we're talking about N7, Nike also announced the other parts of the N7 collection. Really great collection. Obviously, the cause is great. I really like this blanket. Really looks cool. Very, uh, very well done. I believe the guy's name was Derek. I don't remember his last name. Did a really good job designing the blanket. And um, there's also the Roshi run there's uh, gear there's like a sweater a jacket I think there's an AW77 hoodie and then there's also the high Air Force One high definitely like the Roshi one more than the Air Force One high but that's just my personal opinion it's up to you whichever one you like those are scheduled to hit on October 31st so check those out if that is something that you're into um, switching gears a little bit to Adidas they uh, released a, a ZX700 which looks absolutely amazing I love the blue colors that they use it's called Deep Patrol and Seawater are the colors that they use and they have a new buck on the upper nylon just looks really great to me personally I really like the shoe and I thought I would point it out to you guys it's available now at sneaker politics it's only $75 good looking runner in my opinion but again up to you whether you like it or not just thought I would show it to you something for you to check out and finally Derek Rose and the D Rose 4 it hit my Adidas today which is their version of Nike ID which allows you to customize the shoes the way you want to lots of great color options there's eight different parts of the shoe that you can actually customize I was hoping that they would do more for the quarter panel right now there's only four choices for the quarter panel but you still get to do some really cool things if you're into customizing shoes and then the price is amazing it's only $165 the shoes $140 customized version is $165 that is crazy you usually don't get that anymore so if you're into customizing shoes and you really like Derek Rose then the D Rose for my Adidas is probably a really good shot for you so check that out over at myadidas.com I'll put a link in the description for that as well and with that being said I think that's it oh also uh, Chris Paul I visited the uh, Nike vault here in LA where Jordan Brand took over for Chris Paul so you can check out that video somewhere in here not sure where that's going to be exactly and finish line if you didn't yesterday go vote for me on finish line the style your kicks contest me and eight other people were chosen to style a pair of Puma disc blades I did my thing I think I think it looks cool I tried to do something different so if you like it go over there and vote for it and if uh, I, you, I get enough likes on my picture then I win which is really cool and I'll pass on some of those winnings to you guys or one of you guys in a contest Test that I'll make up at that time and we'll find out how we'll do that but we'll get to that bridge when we cross, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it uh, with that said I am Jacques Slade this is the vlog style today at sneaks let me know actually here's a good question for you guys for the comment let me know if you like this vlog style or if you would rather me do it in the studio let me know down in the comments and we'll work with that for this for this week I'll do it this way except for Friday I'll go back in the studio and do the regular show on Friday but the rest of these I'll do a vlog style you guys let me know if you like them with that being said I'm Jacques Slade this is today at sneaks like favorite subscribe all of that good stuff appreciate you guys really love that you guys watch these videos and uh yeah all of that good stuff all right talk to you soon peace